بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم گڈ مارننگ گریٹ فور ٹوڈے ویل ٹیک اندر لیسن اباؤٹ اسپریڈ شیٹ اور مائکروسافٹ ایکسل بٹ بفور وی ٹیک ٹوڈیز لیسن لیٹ می کوکلی ریوائز وٹ وی فنش ان اوور لاسٹ کلاس ان دا لاسٹ لیسن وی ٹاک اباؤٹ دا ڈفرینٹ پارٹس اور ڈفرینٹ ایلیمنٹس اور ڈفرینٹ فیچرس آف مائکروسافٹ ایکسل We also learned about the rows, the columns, the cell, the formula bar, the different parts such as title bar, tags, groups, and status bar, and worksheet so on. Now, in today's lesson, we'll be talking about how to insert data in a spreadsheet. There are different ways in which you can insert data in a spreadsheet just like in word processor you can insert data in a spreadsheet but take care in a spreadsheet we insert data as we are putting data in a table in a table in a word processor so first of all to insert data we'll open a spreadsheet now in spreadsheet just make sure that you go to page layout and make sure that your spreadsheet is from right left to right direction this is left to right as you can see from a to b c d and so on now there are two ways to insert data the one is by clicking on a cell and start writing it will write or another way is you click on the cell and you click in a formula bar which we studied in the last class and you start typing it will be shown in the cell so these are the two ways in which we can insert data in a spreadsheet now the question is once i put data in my cell how can i go to next cell there are multiple ways in which you can go to the next cell first one is enter key if you press enter key it will go to the next cell but not to your right to the down one if i press enter it goes to the next cell but down but for example if i want to go to next cell that is or next column that is b i can use the key tab key to go left or right i can use tab key so for example if i press tab key i'll go to the next column and so on if i press tab it will go to the next if i press shift tab it will go left without shift it will go right with shift it will go left and with enter it will go to the cell down and the last one is i can use arrow key to move the active cell freely as you all know this is active cell this is the the thick border one so if i use arrow key le right left down up i can freely move or simply the i can use the mouse to go to any cell date of birth so this was today's lesson of how to enter data let me put some data for a student 12 okay and so on we can add data if i press enter muhammad 30 and so on so this is how you can insert data in a spreadsheet one last thing is how i can correct if for example by mistake i wrote this date of birth incorrectly so there are two ways if you want to completely write it again just click on it and start typing but if you don't want to completely erase then make sure you click twice quick left click left click twice quickly 
and then you can adjust otherwise if you click once you cannot edit it will erase the whole text so if you want to just edit something not completely erased double click or click twice quickly and then you can or just select the cell in the formula bar click and then you can add it accordingly okay so this is how we insert and how we edit data in a spreadsheet for the homework please do this page activity in the home and there will be a worksheet you will find it on the school website for any question regarding today's lesson please, please feel for fee, please feel free to contact me on my whatsapp have a good day and goodbye